it's been quite an entertaining run for the Super Eagles in the African Cup of Nations 2023 slash 2024. Trust me, it has been tension. It has been time for joy. It has been time for happiness. It has been time for celebrations. And now we are at the major, major stage where Nigerians have come to the finals and Nigerians are saying, please do us a favor and actually bring this cup home. Will they be able to actually bring the cup home owing to the fact that we are actually meeting a team that have been resilient throughout the competition, though down sometimes, but they are able to pick themselves up and they are also in the finals. This is a team we actually met in group stage and then we beat them 1-0 and now we are meeting in the final. Will the game be very easy? Will it be the same thing? That's the question Nigerians will have to answer and I'm going to be interviewing them. But before I do that, let me introduce my name myself. My name is Emeka Simon and this is Final Whistle, the channel that gives you everything football, from football analysis to football reviews to fans reaction to football news. We'll make sure you get the best and we are always the one that bring it the way it's supposed to be. Now I'm going to be interviewing a fan to know what to feel about the next game. You would want to hear what he has to say because he knows how to create analyze this stuff let me invite him and let us see how it pans out my brother Snow man. how are you doing i'm very good i'm very good how is everything Fine, thank you. it's been an interesting ride for us yes, yes from the group stage down to the round of 16 down to you know the semi-final the semi-final the quarterfinals yeah, to the semi-finals semi, yeah. and now we are actually in the finals, in the finals yeah. now basically just analyze it generally for how have you feel what is the the emotions going up and down and all that can you just say something about yeah. the last match and then how you felt generally it was a wonderful game okay the the team they played well they played well we started poorly but now they've been able to come up to the expectation and they delivered okay. i think our game against uh, south africa i like i said before it was our toughest game yeah so the boys uh, they delivered actually they delivered we had the likes of um you know like is daniel no bad song yeah we had uh Ekon having no bad game in this yeah. tournament we had onyeka the tank the tank rapping us well that guy is a beast although we had um it will be still not coming up to expectation okay Mwabali. Mwabali dropped a little quick 10 over 10 performance yeah. against south africa wonderful game wonderful boy boy wonderful bobo 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 god bless you bobo uh we had um the likes of uh senior man Kel, Kels, yeah and uncle k kenneth omero yeah they came and did senior man's doing yeah calm down play that pen out for let's get this thing let's get this thing done it was a nice game we had uh players like uh I, you know we had a fair game fair game. yeah he missed the penalty but it was a fair game so yeah it was a fair game so it was a wonderful performance by them all right all right now oh, let us move it forward First of all, let me even say quickly that we lost Nigerians during and after that game. And I hope that God gives the family the fortitude to bear the loss. loss yeah. And then at the same time, we hope that they rest in peace because this is very, very important. It was at the process of actually rooting for the country that we lost them. That is to show you the love we actually have. Now, moving forward, let us talk about the game that is coming up, yeah. the finals. It is important we stress that the team we are actually facing is yeah. it was in the same group with us. With us yeah. We actually beat them a go one but, zero, right? That's the good thing. Yeah. That's the good thing. Okay, okay. The fact that um, they were in our group and we won them. So I, I believe they are the ones coming into this final with more tension. You okay, get? okay. But again, we have a lot of history between both countries, okay. Ivory Coast and Nigeria. So far we've played eight games in the Afghans. Okay. We won four, they won four. Wow. So it is going to be a mad game. Okay. But in fact, we lost two semifinals, 2006 semifinals, where Drogba scored 1 0. Yeah. In that game, we had Kanu Wanko, Mikel, uh, uh, OJJ, Okocha, Julius Agao, a lot of wonderful players, but we still lost that game. To show you how good the Ivory Coast side is. But again, this, this particular crop of players that we had, they have shown dedication, they've shown that sense of that this is they are hungry for this thing okay they are hungry so i okay. believe they will get the job done for us all right I all right so. and looking at the the ivorian team a team that actually sacked their coach yeah a team that came from um, um third place. Uh, third, in fact uh what do best they call losers. best losers yeah and then a team that you will first score before you know they will wake up one more <laughs> from nowhere and then you know a goal will enter that is how it has been for them now do you think that these things are going to it will it, it will it energize them or will it make the super egos actually scared of them or something how do you feel that the whole thing is going to really pan out for you for for me in this game i'm looking at that defensive like like the last time I, I was interviewed i talked about the goalkeeping sector yes 
you know, and it, that was what panned out. Yeah. But this particular game it has to be the defense. Okay. The defense will do the justice to this game. Okay. So far, we've considered two goals, and the Ivorian side has considered seven. Wow. So it means they are better. What you're about like better baskets. Yeah. So they should they'll collect more. Okay. In the okay. We are going to dominate that game. I just need that midfield to be solid tomorrow okay. on Sunday. Okay. When you make that midfield solid, we are going to defeat them. Okay. Oshime, just bring on that fight. Just bring, continue what we are doing. Yeah. Yes, it doesn't seem as if you are scoring, but he should continue. We we love him for what he's doing. Yeah. Actually. He should continue, and we are going to defeat them. Okay. This is certain. In fact, this one, I, I'm telling you that no Nigerian will have to die for this one because we are not going to the finals. Okay. It will be decided under 90 minutes. Okay, okay. If you watch the Ivorian side, their their defense is shaky, Very unlike shaky, yeah. the uh, South, uh, uh, South African counterparts. Yeah, those guys were solid. Solid, now. yes, exactly. The Ivorian side, they have good forward. Yes, yeah, Sebastian Hala, uh, Sangari, and all that. Kese, forget all those ones. When it comes to the field of play, we are better. So if we maintain that our midfield, because our last game they broke us. Yes, the South African side broke that midfield. You could see the way passes were piercing through that oh, midfield. Yes. Now if we that is why I'm begging you, Wobi. I don't know what we did to you. Please. The innate boys. Talk to this guy. Talk to this guy. Use the Oibo. Talk to this guy. He has to step up step his up game. game. Yeah. For God's sake. We had Onyeka doing double jobs that day. Onye- if I, the only work, it will be, I think the, the side he played was he will collect the ball and turn it back to them. Yeah. I'm not telling to, I'm not saying this to put him down, but he should step up his game. Okay. We need him in that midfield. Yeah. We we because I believe in Iwobi. I'm an Arsenal fan. I know what he can do. You know, that drive. Onyeka is doing the dirty job. Thank God, Onyeka is going to play our finals for us. So, yeah. we're going to have a field game. Okay. If you ask me. Yeah. The Pacero is another person nobody's talking about. Pacero has been wonderful. Pacero saw the crop of players he had. He built a formidable team. Yeah. Around that, those crop of players. So, this guy... Nobody expected this from him. Exactly. See, he had the worst CV, just like giving an intern the CEO's job. Today. Yeah. And he delivered. So, Pacero, 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 thank you for that one. All right. Uh, we should not sleep on these guys. Any moment, any chance you get, you bury it. Yeah. You bury it. One zero lead is not a lead. That's true. It has shown. Yeah. Pam, pam, pam. You go your way. Exactly. By the time you're giving it two zero, you knock their morals down. Yeah. Everything in them will be down. Exactly. One zero, there's still that little fight in them. That dog fight is still in them. Yeah. Please, they should do this thing for us. All right. Um, final question. We've been able to deal with the elephants. Yeah. We've handled, you know, the antelopes. antelopes yeah. We've come to bananas and bafanas. <laughs> We've been able to mess them up. And yeah. now, what is even what do we call the ivory? The ivorians, uh... I can't even remember. Whatever. But what do you have to tell them, basically? Now you look at the Ivorian straight to the face and tell them that uh, what you have to tell them. I'm sorry that you you guys had to spend that much money to to organize this competition, mm-hmm. but uh, it, it wouldn't be yours. This is not the first time it's happening. So it's uh, we've had people organize the. In fact, Ivory Coast has organized this same competition and did not win it. So exactly. it won't be the first time. This won't, this won't be their first rodeo now. I think they should be used to it now. Okay. Uh, so <laughs> take out uh, focus on other things, you know. Uh, a topic the likes of DDA shouldn't cry much. You are you are a legend, you did your part. I'm seeing him all the every time they they, they yeah, buga, buga. Yeah. forget that thing, Baba. Rest this one out, please. We need this one more than you. This one we need a little joy in our life right now. Exactly. I think this is football. Let, let this one go. Oh, thank you very much. You go thank you, God bless you. Thank you. Great. Vamos, boys. Yes, vamos. Vamos, Let's go. Toru, vamos, actually, you can you can hear him clearly. He made it very, very clear. And trust me, he has actually nailed it from every angle we need them to be clinical we need them to step up their games we need them to be able to score more than one we have the capacity to beat this team although this team have shown that you can be struggling and still come up but still yet super eagles from their first game it has been a struggle down to this point so we can actually win this